Good day, mga kalustin. Um, today is our flight going back to Cebu. So, our exposure is almost done. So, we'll go back to Cebu for our retreat. And then, for this content, we will, we will discuss um, what we have learned from our exposure. And then, I will show to you the video of what happened right now in Ukraine and what the church did, especially on the promoting peace. And so, I hope you watch this video until the end and see you around. Welcome back to my channel, Marapalo Spins. And so, two days ago, we went to Cathedral, the Antipulo Cathedral, the sanctuary of our Lady of Peace and Good Voyage. So, we went there, we asked, uh, we thank the Blessed Mary that she guide us, protect us, as well as when we arrive here in, in Antipolo, she welcome us by using some people who are very um, shall we call it, religious people. And so, um, first thing in Antipolo, our, our exposure is very become successful we meet some people and we have some activities we, we are given an opportunity to have a recollection for the advent recollection during the in December and then as during this season the Lenten season we were able to have to give them the Lenten recollection and those are uh, positive feedback to the people, to the parishioners, and so we thank God for using us as an instrument, and we become we were able to it, um, relay the message, and it's up to the Holy Spirit to touch those people around, and yes. Uh, one of the purposes that are, are staying in Antipolo is to have to review of the situation of the school that should supposedly to be donated in the order. So we may be able to review their cabinet. And we asked some expert of a canon lawyer to help us to determine do some uh, venue for future misunderstanding so that we can uh, see this one and then we will go to or what we should do to eliminate or to avoid this uh, probable issues so yeah we have presented some items, some comments from the expert, from the common lawyer, and so presented, reported already to the superior, and also we able to meet some of, some friends here in Manila, and bonding with some parishioners, altar servers and for the rest of our staying here we able to serve in the, in the church so that's it so we, we, we could say that uh, we have done our best for, for the people to serve and significant the significant of we are staying sometimes alone, so yeah, there, there is a moment of reflecting and 
this this time when we arrive in Cebu, we have, we go directly to the retail house. So this moment to look inside the interior of, of ourselves because this moment <coughs> or this time is we need to decide to make a important decision for our life as a big religious. And yeah, hopefully there are tentative dates and we pray that it will be for so that's, that's on the stage of no? so there will be a simple profession to follow on the diplomat and the priest within this year. Mm. I pray. Please help me pray also. And we'd like to thank we'd like to thank all the people who become part of this vacation. Um, part of this journey. The journey with me to, from the start. The philosophy, the theology, the theology and then yeah, I when I worked for 18 years in a corporate, it really gives me an experience to handle people. But this time, as a seminarian, what we have achieved, we cannot use it because you must strip off yourself. Just to be humble, you, you, you strip out all those that you have achieved in life. So you must become a naked person. Yeah, and you, as you will wear the virtual humility. Yeah, it's really necessary for you to. Understand this um, your brothers and community as well as yourself. By humbling one, you can adjust to become flexible on how to deal with those who are. Um, because there are some which is. Because every one of us has the back side, and it depends on. How will you carry it? How will you handle it? As long as you will not stick on those some rights of you know. I really thank God that I reached this, uh, this stage of magic for 13 years. Thirty years inside in the seminary, and very grateful that I able to persevere, overcome. <laughs> Imagine I I feel to be your subject in philosophy, but it doesn't mean that it will be the end of my vocation. When I first decided to pursue, so I look for another community. And thank our uh, six community only one God's activity and give the chance to pursue this program. And so we're here, almost finished. We're almost on the finish line of the race. So thank you and thank all the people, my community, my family, my friends. The springboard of my strength.
Yeah. 